I know what you are. You're a... You're a... Say it. Nerd. We interrupt this lame attempt at an introduction to bring you the introduction. Video games. Like them. Love them. Want some more of them. One way or another, you've got an opinion. And I've got a geek out. When I originally conceptualized the idea for this series, I asked everybody on my Facebook, name some types of nerds. When the topic of video games came up, in conjunction with the topic of sports, there was much debate and discussion over whether video games and sports could be nerdy due to the mainstreamness. Is that even a word? Due to the fact that the activities are quite mainstream these days. Everybody plays video games. It's no longer a us versus them thing. When you've got rappers talking about putting Xboxes and Playstations in their rides, you know it's hit the mainstream. Actually, it has been for a while. Super Nintendo Sega Genesis. So today, I went out to the mall. My favorite place. To get some opinion from the man on the street. Do you think that playing video games is nerdy? No. 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 Not no. at all. No? no? Unanimous no. No. I play video games all the time. Why? Uh, because I just don't think it's like a nerdy, necessarily, it's like a nerdy pastime. Why do you think that? It's fun. It's fun, like you can kill people, man. It's not nerdy because because you play video games. It's fun, it's just a hobby, you know? Do you think that video games are nerdy? Yes, but I love them so much. Yes. Uh, a little bit. <laughs> a little? That's a bad thing. Do you think that playing video games is nerdy? No. Do you think that video games are nerdy? I love Call of Duty. I love Call of Duty. It's like one of my favorite games I'm ever. looking forward to the new Mario Brothers game. I'm counting down the days. It's a little nerdy. It's more of the type of game that you play. Like if you play a sports video game that's not really nerdy, more like RPGs are away from the mainstream. That okay. Yeah, I consider nerdy. that nerdy. It's not really the video game itself. It's people who play the video game. So like you can get nerdy about video games? Yes. But, okay, so it's not the game's fault. No, it's not the game's fault. No, not at all. <laughs> Do you think that playing video games is a nerdy thing? Not at all. No? Because I'm a cheerleader and I play lacrosse and I play COD maybe about three hours a day. <laughs> and I cannot help it because it is so Ma'am, I'm going to shake your hand right now because that is very, that's very exciting. <laughs> you think some people think that it might be? Some women. So men play video games? Yeah. But not women? Some do. I met a cheerleader at a place called Call of Duty today. Yeah, but that's like, how rare is it? <laughs> I guess it could be nerdy if you like make it a lifestyle and completely live to play a video game, but just kicking back with your bros and playing a little game, like there's nothing wrong there's with nothing. that. Why do you think sports games are okay, but like role playing games are not? Well, I don't think sports games are okay. I think they're <laughs> stupid. But, um, you should just go play sports. <laughs> but, um... And most of the people who play sports games probably could play sports too. That's kind of weird thing about yeah. it. Yeah. 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 They probably do. What kind of games do you guys like? I like, I like sports games, like FIFA, sports games. Madden. Sports games. I think that there's like a stereotype that is like a nerdy gamer. But not necessarily all games. No, I think that if you're a gamer, it does not uh, require you to be a nerd. I like Halo. Okay, Halo. you like sports games, FPS, stuff like Call that? Call of Duty. Yeah. Call yeah. of Duty, okay. You play Call of Duty? I just met a cheerleader that plays Call of Duty. Dude, yeah. that's some <laughs> particular number. So, there you have it, folks. While video games may not be inherently nerdy, like most other things, you can still geek out on them. As for me, my thing was not so much actually playing the video game, but I can't say that I don't geek out on video games in general. I still get really excited when I see a new game coming out that's really awesome. I usually don't actually play them. I more kind of like to watch them, or really watch other people play them. That's fun to me. When I was in junior high, my best friend Joel, Cactus Forever, had a Super Nintendo. Yeah, I had one too, but he had games. Games. I only had a few. Hey, that was a rhyme. <laughs> so we would play through RPGs like Final Fantasy 4, known to you savage Americans as Final Fantasy 2, Final Fantasy 5, Chrono Trigger, Final Fantasy 6, Secret of Mana, Breath of Fire, Breath of Fire 2, Zelda, Link to the Past, not Earthbound, Earthbound sucked. If you liked Earthbound, you suck. Just kidding. Just kidding. But seriously, it sucks. We really liked role-playing games. We wanted to make them too. So I can definitely say I geek out on video games, even though I'm not very good at a lot of them. Take first-person shooters, for example. <laughs> I'm terrible. But my brother, on the other hand, had great aim and he was awesome at Counter-Strike and stuff like that. I'm sure if he got into Modern Warfare 2, he'd probably be really good at that. Oh, speaking of Modern Warfare 2, have you heard the news? Nerd news! <laughs> so apparently Activision royally screwed over the PC players for their 
their new game Modern Warfare 2. The problem was the users hosted the servers, which gave the users the opportunity to open up 10 browser windows and a million other things to lag the server so they could get perfect ping and totally boom headshot everybody, ruining the game balance and making it not fun for anyone except for the guy who was running the server. So what happened? The nerds struck back. Explanation in the doobly-doo. I know a guy who knows a guy who's developing an emulator so they can play on their own privately hosted servers. Dedicated servers. I'm not entirely sure if this was legal. Is that legal? Low water. So, I'm not necessarily recommending that you do something like this, but I do think it's a good sign of nerd power. Nerds band together and fight you! Anyway, that's all for today's installment of Geeking Out. My name is Bud Newman, and I geek out over video games. Video games. That's how it's gonna start. Let's get to the start, man! Nerdy is... I don't know, man, like... <laughs> Dungeons and Dragons or something, I don't know. <laughs> I enjoy video games, so okay. my vote is no.